I'm proud to use my authority under the Antiquities Act to establish the — and I, I want you to know it's a big deal — the <laughs> Havanaqua May. I, I'm, I'm having trouble. Thank you. I got it. I just know it as Spirit Mountain in Nevada. It's one of our most beautiful landscapes. It ties together one of the largest contiguous wildlife corridors in the United States, 500,000 acres. Breathtaking. Breathtaking deserts, valleys, mountain ranges, rich in biodiversity, sacred lands that are central to the creation story of so many tribes who have been here since time immemorial. Look, you know, it's a place of reverence, it's a place of spirituality, and it's a place of healing. And now it will be recognized for the significance it holds and be preserved forever, forever. <laughs> Look, second thing we're doing is we're protecting the Kastner Range in Texas as a national monument. This is managed by the United States Army at Fort Bliss, and it tells the story of the tribal nations who live there and the members of our armed forces who trained in those lands. It's also a place of incredible beauty. And right now, right now, as winter gives way to spring, Mexican gold poppies are bursting into bloom. You see, I wish I — what I wanted to do is have all this in a video behind me here, because, <laughs> because when you see it, it's just breathtaking. Transforming desert plains and hills into a sea of vibrant yellow and oranges, framed in the rugged mountains of the blue sky. The people of El Paso have fought to protect this for 50 years. Their work has finally paid off. And now we'll clear the area of old munitions, create access to the outdoors for communities and parks, and we're going to green spaces that are harder and harder to find. And importantly, Kastner Range will be preserved for future generations.